All right, it's time to get super calibrated by playing the weekly. Okay, not I hate this shop already. I got the seahorse badge earlier, which is pretty incredible. I only have a couple uh, in this weekly that I don't have the badge for in tier one. We're unfortunately going to lose this. Play my game called Flaggle. Sell me on it. Give me a Shark Tank pitch on why I should play Flaggle. You gotta really, you know, walk in, pretend like I'm, uh, uh, I can't think of any other names. Mr. Wonderful? And pitch it to me. You never heard of Shark Tank? You simply pitch the idea to me. And then I determine if it's worth my time and energy. This is such a bad play. Why am I doing it though, is the question. We win miraculously. All right, well, if you've seen Shark Tank, then you should be able to simply pitch the idea to me. I think this is going to be a good... Do we have the... What animal... I feel... Okay, the bunny? The bunny could go off here if we, like, keep the beetle around and try and get a level 3 beetle. I love the beetles. Um... I don't know. I just keep rolling, I suppose. This is kind of... Don't really want to do anything here in this shop. Maybe we get lucky with two crickets and two mosquitoes and level up, I suppose. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to wait and find out. That's the excitement of Super Auto Pets. You never know. We're going to lose. The bear heads. I just realized what the team name is called. That's a pretty good team name. What a waste of my money. What did I just do? Unbelievable. Why do I still have a koala in here? This is such a bad team. It's unbelievable. And I should have reorganized my structure here. They reorganized it for me, but in the way I didn't want it to. We win anyway. Great stuff. A level 3 beetle already? Actually, we're gonna save you to celebrate on the next one. Not interested in the uh, praying mantis. I almost called it the flying mantis. Okay, goodbye to the koala. Hello to flamingo. Roll, save you, and put the pineapple on you. Hopefully we get something really good on the, uh, I think we're gonna loot. Oh! Okay, I was really concerned there with the hippo, but we managed to get through that. Pretty impeccable. We have room for two level ups here. A sub su Hold on, let me retry and uh, talk. Siberian Husky? I think we get rid of the Mosquito for the Crocodile, and then we get rid of the Seahorse for the Siberian Husky. And now we have some Scalers, although the Beetle's not going to get anything, which is not good. So maybe we want to swap it out for the Dragonfly. I don't know. Who, do we, who else do we have in terms of Scalers? Didn't have enough time to take a look at that. I think the beetle might just be strong enough on its own to like really do some good damage. Let's get a dragonfly in there for two scalers at the very least. And a sleeping pe peel. 
Peel back the layers on the sleeping pill. Don't like anything. Oops, all scalers. We get a draft in there. Giraffe. It could work. Hey, I don't know. Maybe we move the crocodile to the front. Okay, we got a lot of scaling going on here. This could work. It's okay, we're, we're building up something new here. We're building up a, a big and beefy team. It'll get there eventually. A poodle? A poodle might be... I think a poodle's gonna be better than the dragonfly. Plus, I already have the dragonfly... Um, what's it called? The, dra the dragonfly sticker. So I'm not interested. Not interested at all. Yeah, I think the poodle's the better bet here. Here we go. <laughs> I, I felt like I was getting something good going there. Oh well, that's the first round, it's a warm-up. This is the same exact team that I just had, is it not? Except I had a beetle. Alright, well, we'll maybe we'll try and go for the beetle sticker again. No doubt in my mind that I was going to win that. Here's the beetle that I desperately wanted and needed. I think I put it on the horse. I think that's the way to go there. Barely. Maybe if I had put that on the cricket, it would have gone better. Now that I'm thinking things over in my head. Why would I do that? This makes no sense. Hold on. Okay, we get a little bit of a stronger bat. Okay, I'll take a draw. I'm not really too impressed with the team though, to be honest. I think we get rid of the horse, roll it for something good. Buy a shrimp, sell a seahorse, roll, buy a jellyfish, buy a beetle. And then we can level up the beetle next. So we got that going. Yeah, this team is definitely not as strong as um, the team I had last time, that's for sure. And yet we still win! Can you believe it? I can't. Just kidding, I can. Two squirrels, a little useless in my opinion, but... What can you do? A lot of level ups here. Not interested in the lobster. I think I sell the shrimp. Everything's getting sold next besides the beetle and jellyfish. We're having a huge uh, blowout sale. Everything must go. Oh yeah, it's, it's a sign from uh, God to send a beetle to the wind. To the moon, I mean. That didn't make any sense, to send a beetle to the wind? What am I saying? I'm spitting, uh, nothing. While some people may be spitting facts, I spit nothing. Okay. Okay, we lose immediately, I can already tell. <laughs> 
Were we on lethal there? Okay, we're, we are now. That's for sure. Okay, sell the bat. Put the garlic on you. I could buy you and then sell you really quick, but I don't think I am. I'm really not getting anything good here. I Okay. Maybe we just put a camel in there and garlic it next round. I guess we do that. That's That's really all I have to work with here. That was almost a fruitful endeavor. That was such a horrible team comparatively to the last one. Absolutely despicable. What an awful... This whole team's getting sold immediately upon completion of this round. What a horrible team. A horse, a chinchilla, and a cockroach. actually pretty miraculous that we didn't lose so goodbye goodbye we'll take a temporary ladybug and a seahorse and we'll put a honey on you the seahorse is also temporary so it doesn't matter it doesn't matter what I do to the seahorse Oofenschmerz? That guy's name was Oofenschmerz. Goodbye to the cockroach. No help. I'm gonna get an elephant in and hope that we get a blowfish. Is a blowfish even available yet? It's not. Okay. I did, uh, I did a little trolling on myself. At the very least, I suppose I could try and level up the elephant before we get a blowfish. It's a strong ladybug team here. No thanks to the horse. What a stupid purchase. All that I'm proving now is that I've, uh, you know, I'm unable to play this game currently. I had a good first game, and then it's just been downhill from there. A bison could... maybe we could get that working. Also, why is my beetle in the front? It's literally the weakest thing on my team. I deserve to lose. What am I thinking? What is going on? Wake up! I've yet to see the <laughs> the one pet that I have am trying to build this team around is the elephant. Nowhere to be seen. I'm keeping the ladybug for much longer than I wanted to also. Did not envision the ladybug still being here on this turn. Somehow we win. Our first win on turn, what, six? Turn seven?
Okay, we gotta get rid of you. We gotta get rid of you. We gotta buy you. We gotta buy you. We gotta roll. We gotta buy you. We gotta sell you. <laughs> we gotta buy you. We gotta roll. Okay, the elephant's gotta get out of here. He's not doing anything. He's... He's proving to be an unworthy accomplice to my hypothetical victory. I mean, luck he is, like, holding his own in the back there. He is kind of popping off in his own little way. I don't know. I'm gonna just keep rolling for... Okay, a camel could do some wonders with the elephant. I think this is the only way that we can get this elephant to have any use. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. I'm hoping for more beetles, but it's not meant to be, I guess. This guy's running almost the same team as me. But they have a stronger yak. I win anyway! Wow! Could you believe it? Not me. Alright, get it. Take him. Garlic. Do we have lemons on this pack? We do. Unbelievable. Yet to find any more beetles. No. I'm unfreezing you for the chance of chocolate. Also, a better scaler than the giraffe would be beneficial. That's a loss. No? Almost. Just saw your stream overlay demo. That looks awesome. Um, no beetles to be found, however. It is really unfortunate. What an awful run. Just pathetic, despicable, disgusting. I don't think I have the brain capacity to continue losing like this for much longer. <laughs> what is this shop? Uh, two cockroaches, a seahorse, unbelievable. Hey, at least we just, we, at least we drawed, we, dr we drew, at least we tied. What am I saying? Spend at least two or three hours just trying to write the CSS for the chat box to make it go top to bottom and have a line break after username. Yeah, it does seem like that should be something pretty simple to do, but. All right, we're gonna spice it up by having the cockroaches make a sandwich. They would have never expected that, but maybe they did. Oh well. Alright, the cockroach's time on planet Earth has come to an end. Goodbye. Can we get a yak? Any yaks about? A lot harder to take website CSS knowledge and apply it to something like that. I know all the formatting stuff, but not really how to implement it. Yeah, I used to have some CSS knowledge, but it, it's gone out the window a long time ago. But I felt like CSS was pretty simple once you got the hang of it or once you understood the basics. Almost made a decent, you know, team there.
Here's the yak that I desperately needed and wanted. I rolled past the beetle. What is wrong with me? Yeah, my brain is obviously not equipped to handle a game as high caliber as Super Auto Pass right now. That's for certain. I'm recording? When did I start recording? I don't need to record this. I just realized I was recording in OBS. Thanks for uh, generating 25 minutes worth of uh, game Super Auto Pets gameplay, I suppose. I'm going to delete after. A lot of people in my class really struggle with it, but I, for the most part, found CSS HTML pretty easy. Yeah. I would agree. I mean, all the fundamentals are pretty easily accessible online. Any, like, resource that you really need to, like, do something. I feel like it's pretty readily available. If you have something, it's pretty easy to figure out how to do it online. I don't need the yak. That didn't turn out well for me last time. I don't know why I put the yak there. That doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but maybe it does. Maybe I'm actually a genius. Maybe sometimes my dumbest plays are actually my smartest. Sure. No, 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 no. I'm not taking that. What am I thinking? Can you believe that? I almost took a squirrel. I guess. I don't know. I don't know. I don't have a lot to work with here. I got a yak that can't gain any extra health. This is just not built into the pack. This cricket is saving my life a couple times now. So I don't know if I should get rid of him just yet. Even though I was considering it strongly. Maybe I just go for a level 3 and put a bison in again. I go for that strategy. I mean, at the very least, he's going to be stronger than the other one was, so. And there's no cans in this, so... I, yeah, okay. I think I need a scaler like a dragonfly or a poodle in there to also, like, buff the yak a little bit. Because the yak on its own is not going to be able to do anything. And also, I died. I think I'm going to... Yeah, I'm on lethal. Give me a scaler. Any scalers? I think I gotta. I think I gotta take that as my best bet. Because now the Yak is going to gain some health, which is great. We lose. Unbelievable. Okay, I'm going to do it. <laughs> we switched to the default pack. A 100% mosquito team was on my mind for a second there, but I changed my mind. Square ice cubes. That's a great team name. I really like the square ice cubes. And now everything's going to turn around for me like you've never seen it before. Do that. Alright. 
we've immediately entered a buy sell meta the metaverse the buy sell metaverse is here whether you like it or not and the swan is going to help us get there the swan is going to do some big stuff for us A little unconventional here, but we got a pretty buff peacock now. Out of that whole situation. And I have another plan in which we sell the beaver and then put the peacock and combine it. So that way we buff our dog even more. Perfect. Exactly how I imagined it would go in my head. Okay. So we sell you. Buy you. Buy you. Buy you. Sell you. Roll. And then buy an otter. And see where the cards may lay. That's fine. I'll put the otter in the front just to give him, a, make him feel a little special, you know. I wonder if my calibrated stream title is not drawing in anyone. Is that a bad stream title? Maybe just calibrated. Does it not give people enough information? Come on, what what more do you need? I'm calibrated. One word to describe yourself on my job resume? Calibrated. Simply and easily calibrated. So now our dog is going to get some additional buffs here, based on the thing, based on these spawns. Oh, that's perfect. We generate an incredibly strong dog this way. Things have never looked better. I think we sell the peacock and put a kangaroo in there. The kangaroo could really do some great stuff behind a unit as strong as our dog. However, we need to be buffing our dog still by buying and selling stuff. So we got to keep that in mind. Don't know I entirely followed what happened there, but it didn't matter. Good night to you, White. Thank you for the luck on the stream. Have a good night's rest. Etc. Okay. To buy? That would be fantastic. Hopefully a spider to replace the spider. It's not gonna happen. So I'll put a honey on this. There we go. Okay, it didn't matter. <laughs> oh no. That's... this is bad. We went against the crisp feet, what can, can you do against a team like that? Okay, here's what we do. This is gonna be huge purchase power here. Alright, so we buy the dog. Do that. Buy the chocolate. Buy the cow. Put it all on the dog. And then buy the rooster. And then put you all the way in the back. 
But we put the dog in the front. He still gets the spawn of the rooster. I think this is the way to go. A little unconventional. But I think it's the way. Maybe we get a shark in there. I'll think about it. A can, I think, is definitely beneficial here. I mean, you can never not benefit from a can. Am I right? Am I right? I think, I think I'm right. That went pretty well. Our dog is getting incredibly strong. Our dog's diet is one to be respected. Okay, well, we don't have enough money to put in the shark just yet, so we're gonna do this, a little unconventional. But it's okay. Holy cow, we're... This is... I mean, this is going pretty great. Although we are on one, so we could die here if, if we really wanted to. Not that I want to, I don't want to die here. We win. Okay, we draw. I'll take it at this point. <laughs> Alright. Wait, when did we get a level... I don't know. Anyway. Sell you. Buy you. Buy you. Do that. And then we buy the shark. Put the shark all the way in the back. Now this... This is what this is the way to go. I want a melon on the shark. I think that will really seal the deal. Oh, a little disappointed that our This is a pretty good team. Yeah, that was just not that was just not going to be going our way, unfortunately. All right, well, let's we'll play a couple more on the default and see if we can make anything work. Very duck focused team here right off the bat. This is a little unconventional, but I think it could pay off big time. Just wait and see. Just wait and see. It's going to pay off huge. Never mind. I take it back. It didn't pay off at all. It paid off zero amount. Two turtles. Unbelievable. Okay, let's see if we... That's a, literally the same exact shop. Unbelievable. Okay. Here we go. Okay, we got something good going here, I think. Just wait. Just wait and see. I'm going to be doing something incredible here. I might go for the level 3 turtle, believe it or not. Perfect. Perfect stuff. Okay. I kind of want to put a garlic on the peacock, though, because that's kind of like the best way to go. I think I will do that, and then the peacock, or the turtle can go onto the duck for now. Okay, we're gonna... We're gonna work on buffing... 
our shop units before we buy the camel, I think is the way to go there. Okay, I hate to waste that on the, you know, what just happened there, but it's whatever. We still win. Alright. This would be a pretty huge buff to the camel. We do this. Pill you. Not yet, actually. Hold on. Okay. We need a big, strong unit for the turtle to land on. I guess it could land on the flamingo for now, because it's the strongest attack unit here. Okay, that's good. What if I get a giraffe behind the turtle, buffing it, and then we also buff the giraffe somehow? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. All right, not exactly how I imagined that going. All right, give me something good here. A monkey is perfect, actually. Holy cow. All right, so we got a monkey. Monkey. And then I think we just do that for now. Although the camel getting the melon isn't really ideal. It's also not ideal for the peacock to be getting the melon, but it's whatever. We're going to have a very strong turtle, though. Hey, it's working out. If we can replace this cricket with something stronger also, that would be swell. Like maybe a penguin that I would like to be a little stronger because we're, we're lacking on some strong units now. Okay. As long as our turtle is like getting decent buffs, I think it could work out. I still think that putting a giraffe behind our that was so bad putting a giraffe behind our turtle would be good okay i think i think it's time for you to go buy you sell you buy you milk you actually i don't want you to get buffs so we're gonna buy the dolphin and then do that. I think this is the way to go. Here we go. This is what we need. Okay, it's a little, it's a little too late for the giraffe. Just a little bit too late for the giraffe. And our turtle is already getting buffed by two different units, so... It's... It's not necessary at this rate. And it's... Our turtle is so strong. And then it makes the two units behind it even stronger, so. Boar could be interesting. I think we do want to swap out the penguin at some point. So maybe we'll keep we'll keep the boar on retainer. Nah, the boar will show up if it needs to show up again. We'll, we'll get it. I'm not going to sweat it. <laughs> I'm not going to sweat it. Oh yeah, easily. We don't even need two strong units in the back, it doesn't matter. It doesn't even matter. Okay. I think we just continue to buff what we have, honestly. You know, hoping you were gonna land on the uh, land of the free, the home of the brave of the seal, but it didn't happen. It's fine. I could have put a mushroom on the turtle. Although there wouldn't have been any point in that actually. What am I talking about?
Yes. A cat could be interesting with this team. Especially put using the cat with the seal. That could do some some good stuff. Not what I want to see, but we have a, oh my goodness, our our turtle is so strong. It's unbelievably strong. Holy cow. This is going to get a win. I would be surprised if this didn't get a win, honestly. Can I get, like, a better food unit, please? Okay. I'll put you in the back then, <laughs> so that way everything on my team has uh, a melon. After the, uh, the turtle dies. We're coming across a full melon team. Holy cow. Victory Royale incoming? Believe me. Yeah, this is simply a winner. This is simply a winner right here. I don't really see any scenario in which this team is going to lose here. I'd be genuinely shocked. Yeah, we win. Look at this team. Look at this. It's so easy. So easy of a win. Thank you so much. We got our level 3 turtle win, finally. That's gonna be a screenshot. That's a screenshot. Level th Look at that! That's such a strong turtle. It's unbelievable, actually. Holy cow. Um, okay. That is, um, yeah, that's a good way to end it.